we cannot set some questions based on properties of tangent. Here we question, let y is equal to 3x minus 8 be the equation of the tangent to parabola at point 7 comma 13 lying on it. If focus of parabola is minus 1 comma minus 1, then find the lattice factor. Let us recall the properties of tangent. For that, look at this figure. We have covered parabola. Focus uh, S has coordinates minus 1 comma minus 1. And uh, we have uh, point P on the curve having coordinates 7 comma 13. SP is focal length. M is foot of perpendicular from point P on the directrix. Okay. Equation of tangent at point P is given. It is y is equal to 3x minus 8 or uh, 3x minus y minus 8 is equal to 0. Then we need to find length of lattice atom of this parabola. We have this parabola ka length of lattice atom. Hai. We have formula for length of lattice atom that uh, lattice atom is equal to 2 multiplied by distance of focus from the directrix. This is the formula for lattice rector. We have focus. Okay, We can find coordinates of point m. We have one property of tangent that reflection of focus in tangent line lies on the directrix. Focus ka kisi bhi tangent line mein jo reflection hota hai wo directrix ke upar hota hai. Okay? So, here m is reflection of focus in tangent to parabola at point P. Okay? So, we can find coordinates of point M. We have a formula if uh, uh, x2 comma y2 is reflection of point uh, x1 comma y1 uh, in line having equation ax plus by plus c is equal to 0, then uh, we have uh, this equation x2 minus x1 over a is equal to y2 minus y1 over b is equal to minus 2 multiplied by ax1 plus by1 plus c over a square plus b square. Okay? So, using this uh, equation, we get uh, coordinates of point m. Suppose coordinates of point m are x2 comma y2. So, we will have x2 minus minus 1 over a. a is a coefficient of x. Okay, It is 3 equal to y2 minus minus 1 over b. b is coefficient of y. It is minus 1 is equal to minus 2 multiplied by. Uh, we put coordinates uh, x1 comma y1 in uh, expression this expression here x1 is minus 1 and y1 is minus 1. So, we will have here minus 3 uh, plus 1 minus 2 minus 8 minus 10 over 9 plus 1 10. Okay? 10 gets cancelled out. So, this will be 2. From this comparison, we get uh, x2 fcs of point m as uh, 6 minus 1 5 and y2 ordinate of point m as minus 2 minus 1 minus 3. So, coordinates of point uh, m are we got the coordinates of point M. Coordinates are 5 comma minus 3. Okay. Now, PM is perpendicular to directrix. Slope of uh, PM is slope of uh, PM is uh, 13 plus 3 over 7 minus 5. This is equal to 8, 16 upon 2 is 8. So, slope of directrix will be minus 1 upon 8. Slope of uh, directrix will be minus 1 upon 8. Now, we can get equation of directrix. We have a point and slope. So, equation of uh, directrix will be uh, y plus 3 is equal to minus 1 upon 8 multiplied by x minus 1. So, equation will be x plus uh, 8y, x plus 8y plus 19 is equal to 0. If you check this uh, is point ke coordinates, you will get 5 
minus uh, 24 minus 19 plus 19 is equal to 0 correct okay so we have equation of dietics now we can get uh, length of letter sector formula is this 2 multiply by distance of focus from the dietrix so letter sector will be 2 multiply by distance of uh, focus from dietrix it is minus 1 minus 8 plus 19 over square root of 65 this is 10 so we have 20 over root 65 okay so this is the length of lattice sector uh, here we used uh, one property of tangent that uh, reflection of focus in tangent to parabola lies on the directrix okay let's have a more question 